All right, there's not a lot of information in that video, so I'm gonna give you my first impression, but if somehow the creator or the comment just adds some context that I missed, I'm willing to be wrong. But here's my first impression. The commenters on that video are acting like he's a badass for doing it live. That arc is not because it's live. That arc is because it's live under load. A qualified electrician can do that install without it being dead, so still do it live, which you shouldn't, but a qualified electrician could do that install live without the arc. And the fact that he was surprised by the arc if he really was not expecting that to arc, shows he's not qualified. He should be nowhere near that install, dead or alive, because he doesn't understand the circuit enough to know that that arc should have been expected. The arc can be avoided by removing the load, turning off the main breaker downstream. It's not gonna, it's still gonna leave, if you turn off the main breaker, it's still gonna leave it live where you are, but it'll remove the load and remove the arc. And that arc just isn't a safety thing, it makes it a bad install. That's bad for the cable, bad for the lug, leaves residue on everything and so if you notice as it, when he's making the connection I don't know if it's a trick of the camera or if I really saw this there's a nut in the, in the connection next to where he's working that is arcing at the same time making me think that connection is loose as well and the load as the load's completing there or the connection's completing there the load is arcing there which makes me think everything's loose and not torqued properly in that cabinet it's just crazy and I didn't see this mistake in the video because the video was too short but when you're making three connections like that, the two huts and the neutral, if you do them in the wrong order under load, you're gonna destroy everything in the house. If the neutral's connected last, you're gonna have a, it's gonna be, create a, basically a lost neutral in the house and put everything in a 240 volt series circuit. Yeah, it's just crazy. So don't do it live ever, but especially don't do it live if you have so little clue what you're doing that an arc surprises you. Wow. Thank you very much.